Brandon Pajemski, Jalen Green, Malik Monk, Steph Curry, and Denny Avdia are all on the outside looking in. Who will be my favorites? My top five plays for today. It is Friday, December 22nd. We're talking FanDuel, but we're doing it after this. First and foremost, I need you to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you know when everything goes live, and follow me on Twitter, at Josh Engelman. But the biggest thing that you can do right now is this. It's the holiday season. I want you guys to sign up at Stochastic. The promo code is HOLIDAY. You can get it for 25% off. And by it, I mean anything we have at Stochastic. Weekly pass, monthly pass, whatever sport, sims, lineup generator, whatever it is you're looking for, whatever package you find that you want at Stochastic, you get it for 25% off. Incredible deal right now. We are not gonna be running any sign-up deals for a while. So if you've been looking to get in, this is the way to do it. This will expire December 26th. First up at number five, we've got Dwight Powell. Power forward center eligible, 3,900. Projected for 29, the goal is 26. Sorry, projected for 19, the goal is 26. Winning lineup 38% of the time. I went 22 minutes. The Mavs are extra special shorthanded. So he could play more. 0.85 fantasy points per minute, seven points, six boards, two assists, and a stock. What you're really looking for here is a guy that's $400 above the minimum, likely the starting center, but also has power forward eligibility. Our next Mav for today with no Luka, no Kyrie, no Josh Green, no Maxi Kleba, no Derek Jones, sorry, no Derek Lively, is Derek Jones. Small forward, power forward, eligible, 5,800. Projected for 31, the goal is 38, winning lineup 45% of the time. He starts and plays a ton of minutes anyway. I gave him 36 in this one, 0.85 fantasy points per minute, 14 points, six and a half boards, two assists, two and a half stocks. You get small forward, power forward eligibility as well. He's just in a place where he can soak up as much as he needs to. And in this matchup, given that he's gonna get a start, the expectation should be as many minutes as he can handle. They're running out of real NBA players. We leave the Mavs temporarily to go to Drew Eubanks, power forward center eligible 4,100, projected for 24, goal 27, winning lineup 54% of the time. We've got no Yusuf Nurkic tonight for the Suns, and they are taking on a Sacramento Kings team that doesn't have a very good defense. Nine points for Eubanks, assuming he starts and plays 24 minutes. He's a fantasy point per minute guy. Seven boards, an assist, two stocks. But just like Dwight Powell, Drew Eubanks has power forward center eligibility. That power forward eligibility changes everything and makes Eubanks an excellent point per dollar value option. Back to the Mavs for Jaden Hardy, number two. Shooting guard eligible, 4,900, projected for 34. The goal is 32. He's in the winning lineup 64% of the time. I went 32 minutes. I assume he gets the start and takes every shot he wants. 29% usage, 20 points, five boards, four and a half assists, a stock. He's like a 1.1 fantasy point per minute, dude. The price tag just doesn't reflect the role that he will have today with no Luka and no Kyrie. And that means Jaden Hardy is a incredible play but not the number one play. He gets edged out by Tim Hardaway, shooting guard, small forward eligible. That right there is probably what does it. 6,300 projected for 38 and a half. The goal is 41 and a half. Winning lineup 65% of the time, 36 minutes for Hardaway. A fantasy point per minute at a minimum. 29% usage, 27 points, five boards, three assists, and a stock. He looks great because he's got a 31% usage rate over the past two seasons when there's no Kyrie, Luka, Christian Wood, or Spencer Dinwiddie on the floor. I went lower than that, and he's still my number one guy. Gotta get to Tim Hardaway Jr. Alrighty, folks, that will do it. Those are my NBA DFS contenders on FanDuel for Friday, December 22nd. DraftKings version, around here somewhere. Check it out. Good luck tonight, everybody. Win some money. I'm back again Christmas Day for another edition of The Contenders.